The one and the only, the triple, the G-O-D. And it's Jock King. Yo, um, shit happened this weekend, man. Like, a lot of things. A lot of things happened. And I'm like, yeah. and I'm like, the streets didn't hear a lot of what I've had to say this weekend. But there was something else that happened. Something else that maybe, maybe we should speak upon, dog. It's finally okay. happening, dog. The thing yep. that you wanted in that game is finally going down. And as yep. information I found out this morning, dog, this is actually canon to that series, dog. This is what? It's canon. What? Yes. Are you serious? Yep. The stuff that's going to happen in the Toy Story world. It's supposed to be like a, a technical like side movie, but it's canon to what happened. So, Andy's gone at this point. He went to college. So, they at the right. girl. So, I guess they at the little girl house now. Right. So, they at the little girl house now. And this crazy shit is happening, dude. This shit is nuts. I'm like. Okay. I'm like. This nigga hopping in, this nigga hopping in motherfucking mech warrior mechs and shit, dude. I'm just like, damn. I'm like, I'm like, nigga. Uh, I'm like, speaking, oh, speaking of mech warriors, I'm sorry, I'm going to interrupt you, but speaking of mech warriors, did you pay attention to some of the, uh, the, I, want, I, I guess you can call them tattoos or whatnot on their face? That, that look like some, that look like some unburst symbols, nigga. I didn't even pay it, it, it 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 looks like unverse, heartless, and nobody's gonna be in this motherfucker. That's that's what I took from it. So well, my need to research on that and find out if those were actually unverse. So I'm like, I can pull up the trailer. But, I can pull up the trailer real quick if you want me to, and I can zoom through it if you like. No, no, no. I know those were fucking unverse symbols. I know what that shit. So I played Dirt Ball Sleep enough to know what the fuck unverse symbols look like, and that's what that shit was. All right. So. so. Here's the question I got. Given the end of that trailer that you own or something, but I got some side shit I want to fuck with you on because I want to get I want to get your thoughts on this shit right here. Okay. I know you aren't familiar for real with the world is not enough, and I have been trying to get you to play that game for fucking years, by the way. And then I'm just putting that out there. World, the world, the world is not enough. That's one of the greatest DS games that not many niggas played, and I need y'all to play that in the streets. Given that that's what happened in Dream Drop Distance and shit, who you think gonna be the outside Square Enix outside of Final Fantasy characters that's gonna be in Kingdom Hearts Three, dog? Outside of Square Enix characters? No, no, I meant outside, yeah. outside of like Final Fantasy characters. I meant because the world is not enough as a character. Because nigga, I think it's time for Chrono Triggers, my nigga. I think it's time, nigga. It's time for I, Chrono Trigger and Aya Brea to team up, nigga, and start whooping Heartless ass, nigga. It's time. Me, me personally, I think they should put. I think it's time to put some Star Ocean characters in there. Me, me personally, I will. I would like to see some Star Ocean characters in Kingdom Hearts. That, that that's just me though. It's only gonna. It's um, only gonna be uh, the only motherfucker they gonna care about putting there is fucking fate ass nigga. He the most popular character in fucking Star Ocean. So okay, we'll put we'll put Faith Line God in that motherfucker then. Shit. And nigga, and then, uh, man, well you know what? Okay. Nigga, nigga, does lightning make an appearance in this game, nigga? Oh, okay, back, back to the Final Fantasy characters. Let's see. I'm Since just Kingdom I'm... Hearts 2, okay, no, no, it's cool. Since Kingdom Hearts 2, they went all the way up to Final Fantasy 10? No, 10 2, right? Because they had 60 versions of... Of the Gold Wings, uh, yes, you are correct, yes. Yeah, yeah, so, so they still got to consider 11, 12, 13... Fourteen and fifteen. So I, I don't, I don't, I don't know where they're going to go with. It. I'm but like, that, you that's get, a shitload of fucking characters they had accepted. You so. get, I'm like, the, the simple answer is you get lightning and Noctis, and you call it a day. You get some surrounding niggas. Around you, 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 you honestly think they just gonna skip over twelve like that? I mean, twelve is what's hot in the streets right now, nigga. That's because it's a fucking remake. I'm like, I'm like. Niggas ain't really caring about twelve. Like twelve is a it's probably one of the best Final Fantasy games ever, but it don't have memorable characters enough to put a Kingdom Hearts to get that old shit factor. It's like Lightning's a gimme because she's she's female new cloud. 
Noctis also a gimme because he's the current hero. I'm like, the city of Final Fantasy NT, the story is is, is, a, is based around him this time. From what I understand, is that he plays a very integral part to the story of, of the city of Final Fantasy NT. So pushing him, that seems to make a lot of sense in that instance. Anybody else that they fucking get from them other games, I'm like... If they if they wanted to get Van and Ash and Bontier in there, I'm like, okay, but I don't think that's something that they really gonna invest in. It's like eleven and fourteen or both RPGs, so unless they really finna push either Prish or Shantato out there, which is what they usually do for both of those games, maybe. But if Lightning and Noctis, and they may push the rest of, of Noctis' squad out there or something like that, it's like they might put Sydney in there. Do do they call what is her name in America? Because they do not call her Sydney in America. What is that girl's name? I think her name is Cindy in yeah. America. Yeah, because they call her Sydney in Japan, and they should have called her Sydney in America. But whatever. So you knock this lightning gimmies. Anything else they want to do, whatever. But here is the other thing, the information that just came out about this on um, this interview that fucking Omura did. It's going to be less worlds, but they're going to be hella more bigger, dog. That's what he said. So given that Winnie the Pooh is in every Kingdom Hearts game, he'll, they're going to have some Winnie the Pooh side shit in the corner. So that don't count. What Disney properties are hot enough that you do? Like, I don't know if this is when you sit up here and you bring a fucking Marvel world into this. I don't know if this is what you do. Here, here's my thing on that. Here, here's why I told a guy I work with. If they do anything, Marvel or Star Wars, it's gonna be DLC. It's not gonna, it's not gonna make the initial read. So, just put that out of your mind. Okay. Because I don't think it's gonna be in there right off the bat. Anything, any reference relate to any of that shit. But as far as Disney Worlds go, they're gonna have to do something crazy. That's like their greatest age of all time. Made what damn it over a few years some bullshit. Uh, yeah, so they gonna have to throw they gonna have to throw this ass in somewhere. Uh Let's see. I'm thinking there might be three more brand new unannounced worlds left. Then all the other worlds will be recurring worlds that need to be, you know, like Hollow, Bastion, um, shit, what's another world? Traverse Town, May Highlight Town, all of those shit. Yeah, may, maybe Daybreak Town. I'm not sure. I, I don't even know where the fuck Daybreak Town is at this juncture, but they might be in there. So, I don't know. You know what? So, I'm, yeah. I'm what? With, okay, I'm with you. Frozen is a gimme. I'm with you on that. Okay. Um, they, they, need, they need some dumb world, like some real dumb shit. Some shit you've never seen coming. I've always wanted them to do something with Treasure Planet, though, but... Or Atlantis, but I don't know... How much motherfuckers actually give a shit about seeing that in their Kingdom Hearts game, Mr. Probably not. None. I don't think. I'm like... I really, like, I'm sitting up here, like, I wonder what else they could really do. I'm like, the thing was, if this was three or four years ago when the game was coming out, I can tell you Phineas and Ferg would have been all in that motherfucker. Mm -hmm. They might still be as a fucking summon. It wouldn't surprise me that Phineas and Ferb running some random shop in the damn game. It wouldn't surprise me. Just because how big Phineas and Ferb are, and then to, and... And then conjunction, Perry! So, I don't know what they want to do with that, so... Oh, I, I I think I know something that, that they might do. In the first Kingdom Hearts, you had Disney K 
castle that was off in the corner. You couldn't go through it. But I, I think you went through it. I think they had some cutscenes or some shit in Disney Castle, and that was it. Kingdom Hearts 2, you can actually go to Disney Castle. And Birth by Sleep, it was Disney Town. So I'm thinking they're going to do something called Disney World or Disneyland or some bullshit for Kingdom Hearts 3. And and it's going to have... Uh, this random smatter with the Disney characters all over the place and shit? That, that is, uh, also, also, I think it's going to be be something like how the amusement park is. Since, since how Sora can like summon... Like, he can do shit dealing with amusement park rides or some bullshit. They're going to have that shit all around in there or something like that. That's the, that's the, I think that's going to be linked to how he's able to do that fucking bullshit. Yeah, that every time that every, that every time he fucking do something, something happens in Disney World where he has to go and go learn a new summit by going back to Disney World. So that might be like the home fucking base or something, nigga. The new Traverse Town or some bullshit like that, but just being straight Disney shit. Yeah. I, I think that, that that's my opinion on that. So, um, what else? What else I'm missing here? Oh, something else I noticed. You notice how as, as these trailers been going on, the last trailer they showed, it was Sora, Donald, Goofy, and Hercules at the same time on the fucking field and shit. I was like, okay, so it's four characters on the field now. With this fucking trailer, they had fucking Woody and Buzz with them niggas as five party members out there at the same fucking time. I was like, holy shit, so I'm guessing there's some more switching out now. They just have everybody out there now. This is fucking stupid, dude. Hey, given, given the world of Toy Story, that makes sense, but I do, but I was like, I don't know. I was like, because, let me see, because I thought they would, because I knew they was going to hop in a toy store, but I wonder how extended they're going to get with Buzz Lightyear. Like, if they do, like, for real, like, side star command shit, maybe. Because you know, you know Zerg going to be the final boss of the damn world. And I'm like, either that or going to be that evil, that evil little crazy nigga from the first movie. I don't know. So, but given that it take place after Toy Story, wait, hold up. Hold up. I just, I need to take back something I said at the beginning of this motherfucker. There's a third Toy Story, right? Yes, there's a Toy Story, a Toy Story 3. There is a Toy Story 3. This takes but, place, uh, yeah, because that nigga, see, I'm sitting up here thinking like, it takes place after, because I forgot Toy Story 3 made me fucking cry. Never mind, that's why I forgot about it. Um... It takes place in between Toy Story 2 and Toy Story 3, which is why they mentioned Andy and not the little girl. I didn't even think about this right now, so my fucking bad internet. My fucking okay. bad. So, okay. Because it was a lot of time. You know, it, 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 it's not, it won't surprise me if most of this shit end up being canon because uh, Big Hero 6 is actually canon too because that, that takes place after the events of Big Hero 6, the, the first movie. So basically, to be honest, I think they said this is going to be the second Big Hero 6 movie, dealing with Kingdom Hearts shit. Now, I, I don't know if they're going to officially bring out an anime feature in the future, but as far as the world goes, this is the sequel to Big Hero 6. That's what the nigga said. So, but I, but okay. I heard they were supposed to be coming out with like a TV show. So I don't know exactly what that means, though. But I still need to mm-hmm. watch. I still need to watch Big Hero Six. I haven't. I need to. This have, this pretty, have got around. Okay, well, I might have to make some time to watch it. So, hmm. Well, I was thinking about playing Dream Drop Distance. Is, is it? Is it still? I still need to play that motherfucker with the 3DS nigga with a motherfucking search with a yeah, Circle Pad Pro nigga. How you were confused? Seeing a young. They are not like nigga. How the fuck does he get all young and shit? Yes, you need to play Dream Drop this is because that will explain how the fuck he is young. They, that, that game was a fucking mind fuck story wise. So yes, you need to play. So do I need? So do I need to wait till I get a PS Quad nigga and play that motherfucker, or do I need? To, or do I need to stick to our original to the original thing we told the internet years ago that you play OG style nigga? So uh, I, I, me personally. I advise you to play them both because that's what I'm doing, or that's what I did. Okay. No, that's what I'm doing. I haven't beat the PS4 version yet, but minus it, minus the it looks prettier, obviously on a PS4. Fuck that. Still, this game was built around the 3DS, so that's how it should be 
played the first time. Me personally, that's how it should be played. Okay, so I need to get us. I need to get us. Um, well, damn, I got a motherfucker. I got a three D. I got a, a new three S XL now, so I could just play it on that nigga because they got the little nub on that motherfucker. So there we go. So, um, let's see. Was there anything else that we missed? Because I fucked up Major League. Uh, it is. All, all, all the fucking insane godlike shit you was doing that entire trailer. I can't wait to do that. But, um, that's pretty much all I got, man. That, I was freaking out the first time I saw that fucking trailer. Nigga, I was like, you gotta be shitting. All that. After all this time, they put, they finally put a core story in there. And I understand why now's the time to do that because this this world would not have been what it was if it was on the PS3 or even the PS2 so it, it, the, the technology probably caught up to where they could actually pull this off the way it needs to be pulled but you do know so, that fucking Toy Story shit was supposed to be in fucking BBS though right Huh? They like like early. Sh- it's like shit in the early stage that their fucking buzz was supposed to be in fucking Bird by Sleep though. So all early stages, but they they probably was like, no, let's not do this right now. Let's not the time. All right, one more motherfucking question. There's one more. Will there be multiplayer in Kingdom Hearts Three? Even though. Even though they fucking took it out of the of the remakes of Birth by Sleep, nigga, will there be some kind of multiplayer feature in fucking Kingdom Hearts Three? I yes, I think there will be, and this fight has nothing to do with anything. But he's already confirmed that there's going to be at least a second playable character in Kingdom Hearts Three. So, man, but. Man, nobody trying to play as Riku ass no more, nigga. I ain't trying to play as Riku, nigga. Fake Sora, nigga. I ain't trying to play, nigga, as um, as um, as juve as juvenile Axel. I ain't trying to do this four hundred degrees ass shit. Fuck a nominee, nigga. Fuck a Kyrie. I ain't trying to do none of this shit. It better be Osama bin Laden from the grave, nigga. And if it ain't that, I don't care, nigga. Come on, bitch. No, I'm being stupid. Look. Um, I just, I, 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 me, me one. I was actually disappointed when they went from Roxas to Sora. I was like, dude, I, um, I don't want to play as this dude right now. What the fuck, man? man. I, I was trying to get in the hang of Roxas' play style. What the fuck is this bullshit? That's why you so, have burnt my sleep. Um, yeah, but anyway. One more thing before we get out of here, because I need to put this on your mind, nigga, because once I get the bread, I'm going to make this move. Did you find your your Game Boy Advance copy of fucking of fucking Chain of Memories? It's in the basement, dude. I always knew where it was. Well, why? B- before Kingdom Hearts three come out, nigga, we need to do the thing we always said we were going to do the thing. Okay. So I'm just putting that out there, internet, that that we're planning to do a thing with a thing, which is a thing, just to let you know, just so we can't get off the hook and say we weren't gonna do it, we gonna do it. So there you go. Okay. All right. Well, I'm going. I'm like, you don't have anything else to add. I'm sitting up here thinking of other worlds. Maybe at Atlantis would be good. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, it's, it's time for my boy TJ Detwiler and the Squadron to run through. Doc, what's up? Recess game. So wait. So wait a minute. So right now, as it stands, there's five worlds that's been revealed so far. Right now, as it stands, or was it four? Let me see. What Toy Story? Big Hero Six, Tangle. T- t- oh damn! I did forget. I did forget about that shit. Yeah, Tangle and and fucking and and Hercules. Yeah, Lips. yeah. Frozen, it, frozen a fucking gimme, nigga. Nigga, you know what? I would love it, nigga. You know what? I'm gonna say this, and I don't want you to get pissed when I say this, but I'm gonna say this. What if they do some once upon a time shit in Kingdom Hearts? Though? Why? Why would I get pissed? I'm just saying. I'm just saying because see, I don't want to remind you that you still have a thing to do. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, I, I don't. I don't think it's going to happen. But it would be nice. It would be nice. I don't think it's going to happen though. Mm, Regina, three. But I, I do here. I do think though, one of the worlds is going to be a live action world. 
because they they kind of jumped the gun with Pirates of the Caribbean because they that they struggled to make that world work and on the PS2 uh, you, you can tell they made they struggled with that shit. So but, now but what live they action, have but what live action shit you got though? Uh, unless they really gonna go dumb and go pop the and pop the Avengers. What other live action feature they got? Unless but it, it is a new Pirates of the Caribbean finna come the fuck out so. I don't, you know what? I, th- 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 it will be interesting to see what live action shit they're going to do. But what, I just have a feeling that they're going to do. But what live action shit they got that isn't fucking Marvel related or fucking Pirates of the Caribbean so they can switch this shit up, dog? I can't even think of shit. But I don't, yeah, watch, but I don't watch movies why, like that. Why? Hey, hold, hold up, hold up. Hold up. Why not Star Wars, nigga? That would be some big shit. I mean, it, it's going to be DLC, but why not Star Wars? Yeah. Well. Because that, cause that's going to take some planning on some time to develop that shit the right way. If it is live action, nigga, that's going to take a minute to pull off. I'd rather have more Tron. Actually, Tron up where I, I, to I, I would I would like Tron too, but there is no more content for Tron to be pulled off. Anymore. Tron so, Uprising, nigga, it was a whole cartoon called Tron Uprising that no one watched. That was really there, fucking good. There, I don't want to put that in there. Well, it, it was the original Tron, which they did already in Kingdom Hearts two, and then their Tron Legacy, which they did in in uh this other shit, Dream Drop. So. Did, I thought they had no Tron, I thought they had Tron shit in Birth by Sleep, or am I misremembering something? No, no that that was Dream Drop Distance. Oh, God. that's Tron Legacy. That, that's the second one that came out. Hmm. All right, so, so matter of fact, I, I actually got to see how that looks on a PS4. I bet it looks amazing. I haven't even got that down for you. All right, so um, so here here here's hoping for a Star Butterfly Summon. We all need that. I'm just. Putting those pop up pop those positive energies out there. Star butterfly summit. Let's do this shit. That say, let's do it. Marco running around doing karate kicks and star butterfly doing sitting up here. Narwhal blast, dog. I need that in my life. So I, I need to sit down. And I'm probably gonna sit down and watch the battle for Muni tomorrow, and I will be back to talk about that on my own. But was there anything else, man? Before I turn this into a video, dog? No, I. I wonder how long it's going to be before we see the next trailer. You know it's going to be a minute because they, they just had one last month and they had a big-ass one this month. Yeah, nigga, we probably ain't going to see nothing right, right until three, what, maybe three months before release, maybe? Probably. I don't know. Wouldn't surprise me. All right, but no, nah, that's all I have, though. All right, let's go ahead and get up out of here. You know I am the one in the young leadership with a G-O-D. And I'm Jock King. I'd like to thank you for joining us for this special assignment of Triple the God and Jock King Speaks on Kingdom Hearts shit. And with that, I'll see you guys next time, man. Peace out. <laughs>